about five years before his death, Taika brought me in and started teaching me changes to the Tanbo Kata. There were four original Kata that he had shared with people, and then he also added to it a break apart Joe or break apart Kane that would break apart into a Tanbo. These Kata, the way he explained them to me, he was never able in the past to have somebody devote enough time to not use the pinch method of changing their grip, changing the long end to the short end. He spent many, many months just with the very first exercise that I'm going to share with you guys today, uh, which is just a sliding motion with one hand. I spent about two months doing that one motion. And then I use the other hand, etc. So essentially, Taika decided that he was going to share with me and worked with me for five years on making these original four kata a little bit different with an emphasis more on grappling rather than striking. The important hand or portion of your stick actually became the back portion, whatever was dangling from the pinky side of the stick. So these beginning exercises that I'm going to show you in this video are the beginning exercises that Taika had me do. I'm going to share them with you in hopes that you can prepare yourself and we can continue letting this kata not end with me but continue on in the way Oyata wanted him to. Center. Yep. That's how I was checking. Tonbo slide exercise one. Start with your hand just a couple of inches from the end, and you're going to have it in the upright position, and you're going to slide down. Till it's a couple inches from the bottom. Turn it up, slide, down, up, down, up, down, up, down. Then what you'll do is you'll be in this general position, right foot forward, right hand on a tonbo. You're going to be upper or single, and you're going to slide and go forward, pick your heel up, slide and go back, slide forward, slide back. Then you're going to reverse it. You're going to be in the long and extended position, and you're going to step forward with an upper, step back with a down. Upper, down. Extra motion to reverse it. Down is the forward, up is the back. Down forward motion, up back motion. Change. Now up forward motion, down back motion. Up forward motion, down back motion. Once you have one hand up and down, and then practice your other hand up and down, you're going to switch and do doubles. So I'm going to have long in back, long in forward. I'm going to step and slide, 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 slide. So I'm advancing and sliding, retreating and sliding. Advance, slide, retreat. And slide. So I'm striking down, covering up that motion. From the side, I should be able to flow. I should be able to switch my stance, go any angle, do left, right, left, right kind of motion. Should be able to slide, do doubles any direction. Should be able to do them 45 degrees out, straight out, 90. You 
You can add any of the spider web type of stances in there. You could even do the flower petal, left, right, 45, 45, straight, 180. The next motion that you will need for key hone, Tonbo key hone, is a retreat slide where the stick goes long. So you'll need to be able to punch, capture, slide. Punch, capture, slide. Punch, capture, slide. So I've got the long end forward, I cover and punch, the long end is back, I capture and retreat, long end is forward. Should be able to do that motion in the kata. You should be able to punch, slide any direction and do it backwards as well. So I should be able to slide and stop long end forward as well as start long in forward and reverse it. Another motion that you need to be able to do is as we've done this sliding motion in the front, you need to be able to also bring it back to where it's hidden. Bring it back behind you it extends, but it is hidden back here. So opponent maybe sees short into the stick. Now it's long. You're going to capture and come around, but they have no idea that you have the range you have because you slid it from behind. Double front, hidden double, hidden double, hidden double, hidden double. Another kind of motion that you're going to do is you're going to be in the long extended portion back and you are making a couple of jabs in the kata. You then need to switch to the long end front, come around, capture, capture. From the other side, I'm here, long extension is behind, I'm making a couple of poking motions, I retract and shoot out, come across, capture, capture. Another basic motion is a capture. So I'm going around and capturing a stick. Around and capturing a stick in this. I'll capture the opponent's arm, I'll capture a stick, whatever's in the way. That is keeping the short end back. You need to also be able to slide and have your long end back. So I need to be able to, to capture with the short end. My left hand and left stick is just being my opponent right now. And then I need to be able to, as it goes around, slide and capture the long end. Bring it back, slide it, here. Poke, capture short, poke, capture long. The long end is capturing. Pull it back and I slid it again. So long poke, short capture, come back. As it goes over, it slides, long capture, comes back, slides forward. So I'm capturing short, I'm capturing long, and I'm sliding again to get back to reset. So three slides. Capture short, capture long requires a slide, pull back, and so I'm sliding it under. As I pull back, if that stick's not there, I'm sliding and coming underneath. I'm making that change. So capture short, 
capture long, back to, back to long end forward, short end back. So just referring to the backhand, short capture, long capture, short end back. Short end back and capture, long end back and capture, short end back. Over the head slides. There are motions in this kata where we come around here, kind of making an equal sign, and come along and we slide on the side of our head and strike and then retract and slide. So I'm sliding two times. I'm coming around, strike, and then flipping this back and my legs go back. I'm sliding from here to here, over the head, strike, heels up, retreat, slide, 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 slide. Slide, 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 slide. One of the final motions in the kata is you're coming up and covering, sliding and coming down. Coming up with a short end on the inside and down. Coming up, short end, sliding down. So the motion, you're coming up, slide, coming up, slide, down. Reset. Up, slide, up, slide, down. Reset. Up, slide, up, slide, down. Reset. Another motion in the kata is a flip up, except you flip up and switch to the long end. So you're short end forward, you're flipping up. Short end forward, flipping up. So you're here, you flip up, you're striking and capturing. In the kata, there are several over wraps and under wraps. Over wrap is when I'm striking once, twice, the long end in the back goes over the top. Under wrap, I strike twice, and my elbow and the stick come up. So I'm going underneath the arm. So over wrap. One, two, over, one, two, under. Elbow goes with it. Over wraps. One, two, over the top. One, two, over. One, two, over. One, two, over. Forearm stick, over, or stick forearm. Over. Under wrap, elbows coming up. Under wrap, elbow comes up. So you would capture and move, capture and move. 